of Stridox Nation. This is Stridox here, bringing in you the news for today. Guys, we have some crazy news out here today, which is going to blow y'all's mind. If y'all can just go ahead and drop that like, I just need, out of all 1.1 million subscribers that I have, I just need three of y'all to drop a like. Just three of y'all. If we can reach that goal of three likes, I will upload another video tomorrow. If we do not hit three likes, I am going to deactivate my YouTube account. Next on the news is Kinsley, and then some guy I don't even know. Supposedly, from what I'm hearing, he is a trick shotter back in the day. I don't know if he trick shots anymore, but I can tell you this, he is no optic scumper. After some deep, deep digging into this story, guys, I mean deep. I literally had to get a tractor, a track hose, some shovels. I was digging down, it's just me, myself, and I. Me, myself, and I found this news, nobody else. This is what happened, guys. This is what Kinsley says on Twitter the other day. Seth and I broke up after being together for two years. I moved out of his house to my friend's house in Indiana for about two weeks to give him time to realize if he was serious. After the two weeks, I booked my flight home and had to pick up my cats. And when I showed up at his house, he had another girl sleeping over at his house. A girl I was actually cool with. He wouldn't answer the door. So I had to get the police involved. I hate how you guys think I'm moving on so quick. But when I showed up and there was another girl there, that that's when I lost all respect for him and knew it was over for good. Now, I'm actually happy. Guys, going by this little argument or whatever you want to call this that Skump and Kinsley are going through, they are broken, broken up now. Apparently, Skump slept with another girl, which I highly, highly doubt that. I don't... Just, I don't know him personally, but you know, the, the one or two times that me and Scump had sleepovers together and played Call of Duty all night and me teaching him how to play Call of Duty, he just doesn't seem like the kind of guy that would do something like that. So, I'm on Scump's side here. Next on the news with Stridox, I come to the conclusion after many, many hours of research. I'm telling you, scuba diving to the deepest, deepest bats of water, all the way to brush my teeth and watching the water come out of the sink. I come to a conclusion, guys. After many hours of research, how much water is actually in the ocean? Well, as you can tell here, after many hours of calculation, I can, it's, it shows right here there's about 97% of Earth's water is in the ocean, okay? So every time you flush that toilet or brush your teeth, I don't know if that water is going in the ocean or not, okay? I just don't know, but it might. So I figured that I should let y'all know this and no telling where this will lead up to, okay? It might help a lot of animals out, in the, out of the jungle. There might be freaking termites. There might be strawberries out in the... I, you just never know, okay? Like sometimes you just don't know where a story is going. You think you're going to talk about one thing, then the next thing it just goes to something else, you know? The fans spinning around, you just never know. Next on today's news, I literally traveled across the internet to find this, okay? It was very, very hard for me to find this, guys. I literally searched about 42,623 websites in order to come across that, guys, there is a mystery soda machine. As you can see right here, an old vending machine without a pass serves up beverages from its seemingly magical inside. You see there's Mountain Dew, there's Pepsi, there's Coca-Cola, and then there's a mystery button. Apparently you press this mystery button, guys, you know, you just get whatever drink you want, whatever age. You could be three years old, pushing that button, getting mystery alcohol. You just never know, man. So you just gotta be on the lookout for things like this in your local Walmarts or malls, your uh, Toys R Us. Um, it's wherever you want to go. If you want to go, to, you know, to Target, you can get some SpaghettiOs or get some, um, get some raviolis, some Cocoa Puffs. You got to just be on the lookout for mystery flavors. I know what y'all are thinking. It's not what it looks like. Guys, next on our news is some very, very disturbing stuff, okay? Every single morning, me, myself, and I get on Twitter, and I'm scrolling down the news feed, just scrolling with my thumbs, just scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. What can I find today? And then, bam! Another one of these stupid ads just pop up on my screen. It says, 
This all-natural cream is proven to enhance your best without surgery. Thank me later. Then it shows this little link. Man, I can tell you right now, that stuff does not work. I'm out here putting it all over my chest and whatnot, and I, I wake up the next morning, I, it's, I, I'm, I look exactly the same. I am very, very irritated. They are very lucky I don't sue. Just, I just wanted to inform y'all and let y'all know what was going on with this, and do not trust this, okay? Because this before and after thing, it is fake. Fake news. That is fake news. And I'm here bringing you the real news. The true news. Next on our news is we are going to be talk. Hold on one second. We got some news. We got some news. Uh huh. Yes. 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 Link me it. Link me it as soon as possible. Yes. Oh, we got it. We got the news right here. We got the news. Let's, let's see what it is. Guys, breaking news. This is very important. Just got it in about 3.4. Seconds ago, this guy right here is on the verge to take it over YouTube. Apparently, that's what I'm getting right now. He is uploading every single day. He's going. He's doing comedy skits, making people laugh. Guys, this is this is going. This has got to go viral. This is going to go crazy, guys. Everyone's going to explode when they see this. What? What? Guys, we can get him on the phone right now. Oh my gosh! I what? Hold on a second. One second. Oh my god! I'm freaking out. All right, let's see if we can get him. Let's see if we can get him. Mhm. Mm it's ringing. It's ringing. Guys, we have Justin. The up and coming YouTuber on the phone with us right this second. Say, what's up, Justin? Yo, what's going on, man? What's going on, man? I really appreciate you having me on your show. Ask me whatever questions. Let's get this show on the road, my man. Let's get the show on the road. All right, man. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just looking at your YouTube channel, man. You have, you're growing extremely quick. I'm not as fast as a lot of other YouTubers, but you're, you're getting up there. You are getting up there. You're just over two point three thousand. 2.3k as I should say subscribers and you are steadily climbing and I'm, I'm pretty sure looking at the comments a lot of people are enjoying your videos what do you got to say about that man I just want to say thank y'all to all my fans that are actually out there watching me just want to show some love show some love to my fans out there because you know at the end of the day that's who really it matters man that's who really matters is my fans and uh, I just want to give a big shout out to them and uh, my family. Yeah, of course, of course. Oh yeah, definitely. And um, you know, my family. Big shout out to them for for believing in me, for uh, believing in me, for making this my career. Yeah. And uh, yeah, man. And my producers and uh, my music, my music uh, producer. I'll, you know, big shout out to that guy. And uh, but yeah, man. And uh, and I want a big a big shout out to God for uh, you know, let, let me do what I like, love to do. Well, that Justin, that is awesome. I, we are very fortunate to be able to talk to you, man. I hope you have a wonderful day. I have to get back to my job. Got to get back to work, man. But it was very good talking to you. And best of luck to your future, my man. Oh, man, thank you so much for having me on your show. It, it was it was a oh, big, thank you, big... Thank you, thank you. Yeah, it was a big time. Big, 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 big fun time on your show, man. Take care, my man. Take care. All right, everybody. That is going to do it for today's news. Um, I tried to get as much news as possible. Really, really, really tough week. It was a really tough week trying to find these news, this news for you guys. But let me tell you, I got it, and it, it was prepared. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Let's go ahead and shoot for 11 likes on this video. We get 11 likes on this video. We will upload another video tomorrow. Thank y'all so much for watching. Stride Fam Nation now over 2,300 subscribers I really hope y'all enjoyed that video guys that was so much fun to make it just came to my to my head and I was like let I want to make like a Keemstar drama alert parry video you know but um like yeah of course me and Keemstar don't talk or nothing like that I just thought it would be kind of fun to make a kind of video the way he makes his videos in a sense but kind of tw make a little put a little twist to it I guess you could say so um yeah I hope y'all enjoyed that video um, again, yeah, it was a lot of fun to make or whatever, and I hope I hope I made y'all laugh. Um, but 
Yeah. Anyways, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. For real, though, it means the world to me. Uh, comment down below, guys. Blow up the comments right down, right there. Just start typing stuff. Type, 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 type. Let me know what y'all are thinking. Communication is key, guys. Communication is key, but on the low, low, though, comment down below and like the video. It really does help my channel grow. Y'all are doing a great job, man. Stride fam, we are out here, okay? Positivity attracts positivity out here. Never forget that, guys. Stride fam for life. Thank y'all so much for watching. I love y'all. Never forget that. Peace. I didn't see you. Right. Oh, they're both here. They're both hurt. They're both Damn, hurt. Boy. One ran to be one.